The man charged in an Ashwaubenon homicide returns to court to enter his plea. I'm a Green Bay Neighborhood reporter Andrew Amuzu with details from his court appearance and what the family of the victim wants next. On Monday, 22-year-old Prez Wade entered his plea. Mr. Wade, how do you plead to first-degree reckless homicide using a dangerous weapon as a repeater as charged in count one of the amended information? Guilty. The 22-year-old had originally faced a charge of first-degree intentional homicide before it was reduced. He also pleaded guilty to bail jumping and now faces up to 67 years in prison. The court finds Prez Wade guilty of first-degree reckless homicide using a dangerous weapon as a repeater as charged in count one of the amended information and guilty of felony bail jumping as a repeater as charged in count two. Prosecutors say it was Wade who in March of 2023 shot and killed 23-year-old Braxton Phillips in an Ashwaubenon apartment. Wade claims it was a mistake. I'll never get him back. Phillips's family appeared in court. I spoke with Braxton's sister, Maesha Bias. And ask for justice for him and ask for the right time to be served because I will never get him back and I want everybody to know that like that really does hurt and I feel like he should have to feel the same thing we feel. Carolina Brunette has also been charged in connection to Phillips's death, including charges of aiding a felon and obstructing an officer. Brunette's next court appearance will be on October 4th. The family says they will be at that hearing as well. Wade's sentencing hearing will be on November 22nd. In Green Bay, Andrew Amuzu, NBC 26.